Mecca, Arabic, Makht Maka Hijazi pronunciation, Mak -a is a city in the Hijazi region of the Arabian Peninsula, and the plain of Tihama in Saudi Arabia, and is also the capital and administrative headquarters of the Maka region. The city is located 70 kilometers 43 miles inland from Jeddah in a narrow valley at a height of 277 meters 909 feet above sea level, and 340 kilometers 210 miles south of Medina. Its resident population in 2012 was roughly 2 million, although visitors more than triple this number every year during the Hajj, Arabic, Hajj pilgrimage period held in the 12th Muslim lunar month of Dhul Hijjah Arabic, Du al as the birthplace of Muhammad, and the site of Muhammad's first revelation of the Quran specifically, a cave 3 km 2 miles from Mecca. Mecca is regarded as the holiest city in the religion of Islam and a pilgrimage to it known as the Hajj is obligatory for all able Muslims. Mecca is home to the Kaaba, by majority description Islam's holiest site, as well as being the direction of Muslim prayer. Mecca was long ruled by Muhammad's descendants, the Sharifs, acting either as independent rulers or as vassals to larger polities. It was conquered by Ibn Saud in 1925. In its modern period, Mecca has seen tremendous expansion in size and infrastructure, home to structures such as the Abraj al Bayt, also known as the Mecca Royal Clock Tower Hotel, the world's fourth tallest building and the building with the third largest amount of floor area. During this expansion, Mecca has lost some historical structures and archaeological sites, such as the Ajid Fortress. Today, more than 15 million Muslims visit Mecca annually, including several million during the few days of the Hajj. As a result, Mecca has become one of the most cosmopolitan cities in the Muslim world, although non-Muslims are prohibited from entering the city. Etymology <inaudible> <inaudible> and usage Mecca is the familiar form of the English transliteration for the Arabic name of the city, although the official transliteration used by the Saudi government is Makkah, which is closer to the Arabic pronunciation. The word Mecca in English has come to be used to refer to any place that draws large numbers of people, and because of this some English-speaking Muslims have come to regard the use of this spelling for the city as offensive. The Saudi government adopted Makkah as the official spelling in the 1980s, but is not universally known or used worldwide. The full official name is Makkah al Mukarama Arabic, Ma Ka T al Mu Ka Rama T or Makatu al Mukarama Arabic, Ma Ka Tu al Mu Ka Rama T make, Kale Makur Rama, make, Kettle, which means, Mecca the Honored, but is also loosely translated as, the Holy City of Mecca. The ancient or early name for the site of Mecca is Baqa Arabic, ba -ka -t also transliterated Baqa, 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 Beka, Beka, etc. An Arabic language word, its etymology, like that of Mecca, is obscure. Widely believed to be a synonym for Mecca, it is said to be more specifically the early name for the valley located therein, while Muslim scholars generally use it to refer to the sacred area of the city that immediately surrounds and includes the Kaaba Arabic, Ka -bati Kaaba. This form is used for the name Mecca in the Quran in 3-96, while the form Mecca is used in 48-24. In South Arabic, the language in use in the southern portion of the Arabian Peninsula at the time of Muhammad, the B and M were interchangeable. Other references to Mecca in the Quran 6 42 call it Umm al qura Arabic, Umm al qura meaning, Mother of all settlements. Mother of villages. Another name of Mecca is Tihama Arabic, Tihama. Another name for Mecca, or the wilderness and mountains surrounding it, according to Arab and Islamic tradition, is Faran or Furan, referring to the desert of Paran mentioned in the Old Testament at Genesis chapter 21 verse 21. Arab and Islamic tradition holds that the wilderness of Paran, broadly speaking, is the Tihama and the site where Ishmael settled was Mecca. Yaqat al-Hamawi, the 12th century Syrian geographer, wrote that Faran was an Arabized Hebrew word, one of the names of Mecca mentioned in the Torah. Topic: <inaudible> <inaudible> Government. Mecca is governed by the municipality of Mecca, a municipal council of 14 locally elected members headed by a mayor called Al -Amin appointed by the Saudi government. As of May 2015, the mayor of the city was Dr. Osama bin Fadhil al-Bar. Mecca is the capital of the Makkah region, which includes neighboring Jeddah. 
The provincial governor was Prince Abdul Majid bin Abdulaziz Al Saud from 2000 until his death in 2007. On 16 May 2007, Prince Khalid bin Faisal Al Saud was appointed as the new governor. History Early history The early history of Mecca is still largely disputed, as there are no unambiguous references to it in ancient literature prior to the rise of Islam. The Roman Empire took control of part of the Hejaz in 106 CE, ruling cities such as Hegra now known as Madain Salah, located to the north of Mecca. Even though detailed descriptions were established of Western Arabia by Rome, such as by Procopius, there are no references of a pilgrimage and trading outpost such as Mecca. The first direct mention of Mecca in external literature occurs in 741 CE, in the Byzantine Arab Chronicle, though here the author places it in Mesopotamia rather than the Hejaz. Given the inhospitable environment and lack of historical references in Roman, Persian, and Indian sources, historians including Patricia Crone and Tom Holland have cast doubt on the claim that Mecca was a major historical trading outpost. Topic. Potential ancient references The Greek historian Diodorus Siculus writes about Arabia in his work Bibliotheca Historica, describing a holy shrine, "...and a temple has been set up there, which is very holy and exceedingly revered by all Arabians." Claims have been made this could be a reference to the Kaaba in Mecca. However, the geographic location Diodorus describes is located in northwest Arabia, around the area of Luque Kome, closer to Petra and within the former Nabataean Kingdom and Rome's Arabia Petraea. Ptolemy lists the names of fifty cities in Arabia, one going by the name of Makaraba. There has been speculation since 1646 that this is could be a reference to Mecca, but there is no compelling explanation to link the two names. Topic. Islamic view In the Islamic view, the beginnings of Mecca are attributed to Ishmael's descendants. The Old Testament chapter Psalm chapter 84 verses 3 to 6, and a mention of a pilgrimage at the Valley of Bacca, that Muslims see as referring to the mentioning of Mecca as Bacca in Quran Surah 3 to 96. Some time in the 5th century, the Kaaba was a place of worship for the deities of Arabia's pagan tribes. Mecca's most important pagan deity was Hubal, which had been placed there by the ruling Quraysh tribe and remained until the 7th century. In the Shar al-Asatir, a commentary on the Samaritan Midrashic chronology of the patriarchs, of unknown date but probably composed in the 10th century CE, it is claimed that Mecca was built by the sons of Nebaioth, the eldest son of Ishmael. In the 5th century, the Quraysh took control of Mecca, and became skilled merchants and traders. In the 6th century they joined the lucrative spice trade, since battles elsewhere were diverting trade routes from dangerous sea routes to more secure overland routes. The Byzantine Empire had previously controlled the Red Sea, but piracy had been increasing. Another previous route that ran through the Persian Gulf via the Tigris and Euphrates rivers was also being threatened by exploitations from the Sassanid Empire, and was being disrupted by the Lakhmids, the Ghassanids, and the Roman-Persian Wars. Mecca's prominence as a trading center also surpassed the cities of Petra and Palmyra. The Sassanids however did not always pose a threat to Mecca, as in 575 CE they protected Mecca city from invasion by the kingdom of Aksum, led by its Christian leader Abraha. The tribes of southern Arabia asked the Persian king Khosrau I for aid, in response to which he came south to Arabia with foot soldiers and a fleet of ships into Mecca. The Persian intervention prevented Christianity from spreading eastward into Arabia, and Mecca and the Islamic prophet Muhammad, who was at the time six years old in the Quraysh tribe, would not grow up under the cross. By the middle of the 6th century, there were three major settlements in northern Arabia, all along the southwestern coast that borders the Red Sea, in a habitable region between the sea and the Great Mountains to the east. Although the area around Mecca was completely barren, it was the wealthiest of the three settlements with abundant water via the renowned Zamzam Well and a position at the crossroads of major caravan routes. The harsh conditions and terrain of the Arabian Peninsula meant a near constant state of conflict between the local tribes, but once a year they would declare a truce and converge upon Mecca in an annual pilgrimage. Up to the 7th century, this journey was intended for religious reasons by the pagan Arabs to pay homage to their shrine and to drink from the Zamzam Well. 
However, it was also the time each year that disputes would be arbitrated, debts would be resolved, and trading would occur at Meccan fairs. These annual events gave the tribes a sense of common identity and made Mecca an important focus for the peninsula. The year of the elephant is the name in Islamic history for the year approximately equating to 570 CE. According to Islamic tradition, it was in this year that Muhammad was born. The name is derived from an event said to have occurred at Mecca. According to early Islamic historians such as Ibn Ishaq, Abraha the Christian ruler of Yemen, which was subject to the kingdom of Aksum of Ethiopia, built a great church at Sana'a known as al kulis in honor of the Aksumite king Negus. It gained widespread fame, even gaining the notice of the Byzantine Empire. Abraha attempted to divert the pilgrimage of Arab people from Kaaba to al kulis and appointed a man named Muhammad ibn Kuzai to Mecca and Tihama as a king with a message that al kulis was both much better than other houses of worship and pure, having not been defiled by the housing of idols. When Muhammad ibn Kuzai got as far as the land of Kanana, the people of the lowland, knowing what he had come for, sent a man of Hudhale called Urwa bin Hayyad al-Milasi, who shot him with an arrow, killing him. His brother Keys who was with him fled to Abraha and told him the news, which increased his rage and fury and he swore to raid the Kanana tribe and destroy the temple. Ibn Ishaq further states that one of the men of the Quraysh tribe was angered by this, and going to Sana'a, slipped into the church at night and defiled it, it is widely assumed that they did so by defecating in it. Abraha marched upon the Kaaba with a large army, which included one or more war elephants, intending to demolish it. When news of the advance of Abraha's army came, the Arab tribes of the Quraysh, Banu Kinana, Banu Kuzas and Banu Hudhail united in defense of the Kaaba. A man from the Himyarite kingdom was sent by Abraha to advise them that Abraha only wished to demolish the Kaaba and if they resisted, they would be crushed. Abdul Muttalib told the Meccans to seek refuge in the hills while he with some leading members of the Quraysh remained within the precincts of the Kaaba. Abraha sent a dispatch inviting Abdul Muttalib to meet with Abraha and discuss matters. When Abdul Muttalib left the meeting he was heard saying, The owner of this house is its defender, and I am sure he will save it from the attack of the adversaries and will not dishonor the servants of his house. Abraha attacked Mecca however, the lead elephant, known as Mahmud, is said to have stopped at the boundary around Mecca and refused to enter. It has been theorized that an epidemic such as by smallpox could have caused such a failed invasion of Mecca. The reference to the story in Quran is rather short. According to the Surah of Al-Fil, the next day, as Abraha prepared to enter the city, a dark cloud of small birds sent by Allah appeared. The birds carried small rocks in their beaks, and bombarded the Ethiopian forces and smashed them like eaten straw. Camel caravans, said to have first been used by Muhammad's great-grandfather, were a major part of Mecca's bustling economy. Alliances were struck between the merchants in Mecca and the local nomadic tribes, who would bring goods, leather, livestock, and metals mined in the local mountains, to Mecca to be loaded on the caravans and carried to cities in Sham and Iraq. Historical accounts also provide some indication that goods from other continents may also have flowed through Mecca. Goods from Africa and the Far East passed through en route to Syria including spices, leather, medicine, cloth, and slaves. In return Mecca received money, weapons, cereals and wine, which in turn were distributed throughout Arabia. The Meccans signed treaties with both the Byzantines and the Bedouin, and negotiated safe passages for caravans, giving them water and pasture rights. Mecca became the center of a loose confederation of client tribes, which included those of the Banu Tamim. Other regional powers such as the Abyssinian, Ghassan, and Lakam were in decline leaving Meccan trade to be the primary binding force in Arabia in the late 6th century. Thamudic inscriptions Some Thamudic inscriptions which were discovered in the South Jordan contained names of some individuals such as Abd Mekat Arabic, Abd Ma Khat, Servant of Mecca. There were also some other inscriptions which contained personal names such as Maki Arabic, Ma Meccan, but Jawad Ali from the University of Baghdad suggested that there's also a probability of a tribe named Mecca. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Islamic tradition. According to Islamic tradition, the history of Mecca goes back to Abraham Ibrahim, who built the Kaaba with the help of his elder son Ishmael in around 2000 BCE, when the inhabitants of the site then known as Bacca had fallen away from the original monotheism of Abraham through the influence of the Amalekites. 
Topic: <laughs> Muhammad and conquest of Mecca. Muhammad was born in Mecca in 570, and thus Islam has been inextricably linked with it ever since. He was born in a minor faction, the Hashemites, of the ruling Quraysh tribe. It was in Mecca, in the nearby mountain cave of Hira on Jabal al-Nur, that, according to Islamic tradition, Muhammad began receiving divine revelations from God through the Archangel Gabriel in 610 AD, and advocated his form of Abrahamic monotheism against Meccan paganism. After enduring persecution from the pagan tribes for 13 years, Muhammad emigrated in 622 with his companions, the Mahahiran, to Yathrib later called Medina. The conflict between the Quraysh and the Muslims, however, continued. The two fought in the Battle of Badr, where the Muslims defeated the Quraysh outside Medina, while the Battle of Uhud ended indecisively. Overall, Meccan efforts to annihilate Islam failed and proved to be costly and unsuccessful. During the Battle of the Trench in 627, the combined armies of Arabia were unable to defeat Muhammad's forces. In 628, Muhammad and his followers wanted to enter Mecca for pilgrimage, but were blocked by the Quraysh. Subsequently, Muslims and Meccans entered into the Treaty of Hudaybiyah, whereby the Quraysh promised to cease fighting Muslims and promised that Muslims would be allowed into the city to perform the pilgrimage the following year. It was meant to be a ceasefire for ten years. However, just two years later, the Quraysh violated the truce by slaughtering a group of Muslims and their allies. Muhammad and his companions, now 10,000 strong, marched into Mecca. However, instead of continuing their fight, the city of Mecca surrendered to Muhammad, who declared peace and amnesty for its inhabitants. The pagan imagery was destroyed by Muhammad's followers and the location Islamized and rededicated to the worship of God. Mecca was declared as the holiest site in Islam ordaining it as the center of Muslim pilgrimage, one of the faith's five pillars. Then, Muhammad returned to Medina, after assigning Aqib ibn Yusid as governor of the city. His other activities in Arabia led to the unification of the peninsula. Muhammad died in 632, but with the sense of unity that he had passed on to his Ummah Islamic nation, Islam began a rapid expansion, and within the next few hundred years stretched from North Africa into Asia and parts of Europe. As the Islamic Empire grew, Mecca continued to attract pilgrims from all across the Muslim world and beyond, as Muslims came to perform the annual Hajj pilgrimage. Mecca also attracted a year-round population of scholars, pious Muslims who wished to live close to the Kaaba, and local inhabitants who served the pilgrims. Due to the difficulty and expense of the Hajj, pilgrims arrived by boat at Jeddah, and came overland, or joined the annual caravans from Syria or Iraq. Topic. Medieval and pre-modern times Mecca was never the capital of any of the Islamic states but Muslim rulers did contribute to its upkeep. During the reigns of Umar and Uthman ibn Affan concerns of flooding caused the caliphs to bring in Christian engineers to build barrages in the low-lying quarters and construct dikes and embankments to protect the area around the Kaaba. Muhammad's migration to Medina shifted the focus away from Mecca. This focus moved still more when Ali, the fourth caliph, took power choosing Kufa as his capital. The Umayyad Caliphate moved the capital to Damascus in Syria and the Abbasid Caliphate to Baghdad, in modern-day Iraq, which remained the center of the Islamic Empire for nearly 500 years. Mecca re-entered Islamic political history during the Second Islamic Civil War, when it was held by Abd Allah ibn al-Zubair, an early Muslim who opposed the Umayyad Caliphs. The city was twice besieged by the Umayyads, in 683 and 692. For some time thereafter the city figured little in politics, remaining a city of devotion and scholarship governed by the Hashemite Sharifs. In 930, Mecca was attacked and sacked by Karmatians, a millenarian Ismaili Muslim sect led by Abu Tahir al-Janabi and centered in eastern Arabia. The Black Death pandemic hit Mecca in 1349. In 1517, the Sharif, Barakat bin Muhammad, acknowledged the supremacy of the Ottoman Caliph but retained a great degree of local autonomy. In 1803, the city was captured by the first Saudi state, which held Mecca until 1813. This was a massive blow to the prestige of the Turkish Ottoman Empire, which had exercised sovereignty over the holy city since 1517. The Ottomans assigned the task of bringing Mecca back under Ottoman control to their powerful Khedive Viceroy of Egypt, Muhammad Ali Pasha. 
Muhammad Ali Pasha successfully returned Mecca to Ottoman control in 1813. In 1818, followers of the Salafi juristic school were again defeated, but some of the Al Saud clan survived and founded the second Saudi state that lasted until 1891 and led on to the present country of Saudi Arabia. Mecca was regularly hit by cholera outbreaks. Between 1830 and 1930 cholera broke out among pilgrims at Mecca 27 times. Topic. Ibn Battuta description of Mecca One of the world travelers to Mecca in the 15th century was Ibn Battuta. In his travels, he provides us with an important description of the city. Around the year 729, Ibn Battuta arrived in Mecca. Immediately when Battuta arrived in Mecca it felt like a holy sanctuary and thus he started the rites of the pilgrimage. He remained in Mecca for a couple of years. During Batuta's second year there, his caravan arrived, "...with a great quantity of alms for the support of those who were staying in Mecca and Medina." p. 51. Giving these alms to the poor also helped to fulfill another pillar of faith, while he was also fulfilling the pillar of making the pilgrimage to Mecca. While in Mecca, prayers were made for the king of Iraq and then also for el Melik el Nasir. The prayers were made in the Temple of Mecca. This temple is very large, but was also destroyed once and was rebuilt a little bit smaller than the original. The temple also contained images of angels, prophets, Jesus, his mother Mary and many others. This temple is one of the most important parts of Mecca due to the fact that many people make the pilgrimage to Mecca for the purpose of going to the temple. The people of Mecca were also an important aspect of the village. They were described as being humble and kind, also willing to give a part of everything they had to someone who had nothing. The inhabitants of Mecca and the village itself was very clean. There was also a sense of elegance to the village. Ibn Battuta spent about three years in Mecca before he left with intentions of moving on to Yemen. Mecca nowadays is a lot different than Battuta saw it, but it still is a place of holiness. The city has become more advanced with new technology, but along with new skyscrapers and event centers, it still contains temples that are important for the pilgrimages to Mecca. Topic. Revolt of the Sharif of Mecca In World War I, the Ottoman Empire was at war with Britain and its allies, having sided with Germany. It had successfully repulsed an attack on Istanbul in the Gallipoli Campaign and on Baghdad in the Siege of Kut. The British agent T. E. Lawrence conspired with the Ottoman governor Hussein bin Ali, the Sharif of Mecca. Hussein bin Ali revolted against the Ottoman Empire from Mecca, and it was the first city captured by his forces in the Battle of Mecca 1916. Sharif's revolt proved a turning point of the war on the Eastern Front. Sharif Hussein declared a new state, the Kingdom of Hejaz, and declared Mecca as the capital of the new kingdom. News reports in November 1916 via contact in Cairo with returning Hajj pilgrims, said that with the Ottoman Turkish authorities gone, Mecca at Hajj 1916 was thankfully free of the previous massive extortion and illegal money demanding by Turks who were agents of the Ottoman government. Topic. Saudi Arabia. Following the 1924 Battle of Mecca, the Sharif of Mecca was overthrown by the Saud family, and Mecca was incorporated into Saudi Arabia. Under Saudi rule, much of the historic city has been demolished as a result of construction programs, see below. On 20 November 1979 200 armed Islamist dissidents led by Saudi preacher Juhayman al otaibi seized the Grand Mosque. They claimed that the Saudi royal family no longer represented pure Islam and that the Masjid al-Haram the sacred mosque and the Kaaba, must be held by those of true faith. The rebels seized tens of thousands of pilgrims as hostages and barricaded themselves in the mosque. The siege lasted two weeks, and resulted in several hundred deaths and significant damage to the shrine, especially the Safa Marwa Gallery. Pakistani forces carried out the final assault, they were assisted with weapons, logistics and planning by an elite team of French commandos from the French Gigan Commando Unit. Topic. Destruction of historic buildings Under Saudi rule, it has been estimated that since 1985 about 95% of Mecca's historic buildings, most over a thousand years old, have been demolished. Historic sites of religious importance which have been destroyed by the Saudis include five of the renowned seven mosques, 
Initially built by Muhammad's daughter and four of his greatest companions, Masjid Abu Bakr, Masjid Salman al-Farsi, Masjid Umar ibn al-Khattab, Masjid Sayyida Fatima bint Rasulullah and Masjid Ali ibn Abu Talib, it has been reported that there are now fewer than 20 structures remaining in Mecca that date back to the time of Muhammad. Other buildings that have been destroyed include the House of Khadijah, the wife of Muhammad, demolished to make way for public lavatories, the House of Abu Bakr, Muhammad's companion, now the site of the local Hilton Hotel, the House of Muhammad's grandson Ali Oraid, and the Mosque of Abu Qubai, now the location of the King's Palace in Mecca, Muhammad's birthplace, demolished to make way for a library, and the Ottoman era Ajid Fortress, demolished for construction of the Abraj al Bayt Towers. The reason for much of the destruction of historic buildings has been for the construction of hotels, apartments, parking lots, and other infrastructure facilities for Hajj pilgrims. However, many have been destroyed without any such reason. For example, when the house of Ali Oraid was discovered, King Fahd himself ordered that it be bulldozed lest it should become a pilgrimage site. <laughs> pilgrimage The pilgrimage to Mecca attracts millions of Muslims from all over the world. There are two pilgrimages, the Hajj and the Umrah. The Hajj, the greater pilgrimage is performed annually in Mecca and nearby sites. During the Hajj, several million people of varying nationalities worship in unison. Every adult, healthy Muslim who has the financial and physical capacity to travel to Mecca and can make arrangements for the care of his, her dependents during the trip, must perform the Hajj at least once in a lifetime. Umrah, the lesser pilgrimage, is not obligatory, but is recommended in the Quran. Often, they perform the Umrah while visiting Al-Haram Mosque. Topic. Incidents during pilgrimage Mecca has been the site of several incidents and failures of crowd control because of the large numbers of people who come to make the Hajj. For example, on 2 July 1990, a pilgrimage to Mecca ended in tragedy when the ventilation system failed in a crowded pedestrian tunnel and 1,426 people were either suffocated or trampled to death in a stampede. On 24 September 2015, 700 pilgrims were killed in a stampede at Mina during the stoning the devil ritual at Jamarat. Geography <laughs> <laughs> Mecca is at an elevation of 277 meters (909 feet) above sea level and approximately 80 kilometers (50 miles) inland from the Red Sea. Central Mecca lies in a corridor between mountains, which is often called the Hollow of Mecca. The area contains the Valley of Al Tanim, the Valley of Bacca, and the Valley of Abkar. This mountainous location has defined the contemporary expansion of the city. The city centers on the Masjid al-Haram area, which is lower than most of the city. The area around the mosque is the old city. The main avenues are al muda and Suk al-Layl to the north of the mosque, and as Sugga Sajir to the south. As the Saudis expanded the Grand Mosque in the center of the city, hundreds of houses were replaced by wide avenues and city squares. Traditional homes are built of local rock and are generally two to three stories. The total area of Mecca today is over 1200 square kilometers, 460 square miles. In pre-modern Mecca, the city used a few chief sources of water. The first were local wells, such as the Zamzam well, that produced generally brackish water. The second source was the spring of Ain Zubaydah. The sources of this spring are the mountains of J, the Bal Sadi, Jabal Sad, and Jabal Kabkab, which are a few kilometers east of Jabal Arafa or about 20 kilometers, 12 miles southeast of Mecca. Water was transported from it using underground channels. A very sporadic third source was rainfall, which was stored by the people in small reservoirs or cisterns. The rainfall, scant as it is, also presents the threat of flooding and has been a danger since earliest times. According to Al Kurdi, there had been 89 historic floods by 1965, including several in the Saudi period. In the last century, the most severe flood was in 1942. Since then, dams have been built to ameliorate this problem. Topic: Neighborhoods. Topic: Climate. Mecca features a hot desert climate. 
Like most Saudi Arabian cities, Mecca retains warm to hot temperatures even in winter, which can range from 18 degrees Celsius 64 degrees Fahrenheit at night to 30 degrees Celsius 86 degrees Fahrenheit in the afternoon. Summer temperatures are extremely hot and break the 40 degrees Celsius 104 degrees Fahrenheit mark in the afternoon dropping to 30 degrees Celsius 86 degrees Fahrenheit in the evening. Rain usually falls in Mecca in small amounts scattered between November and January. Topic. Landmarks Mecca houses Al-Haram Mosque, the largest mosque in the world. The mosque surrounds the Kaaba, which Muslims turn towards while offering daily prayer. This mosque is also commonly known as the Haram or Grand Mosque, as mentioned above, because of the Wahhabist hostility to reverence being paid to historic and religious buildings. Mecca has lost most of its heritage in recent years, and few buildings from the last 1,500 years have survived Saudi rule. Expansion of the city is ongoing and includes the construction of 601 meters (1,972 feet) tall Abraj Al Bayt towers across the street from the Masjid Al Haram. The towers were the third tallest building in the world when completed in 2012. The construction of the towers involved the demolition of the Ajid fortress, which in turn sparked a dispute between Turkey and Saudi Arabia. The Zamzam well is home to a celebrated water spring. The Kishla of Mecca was an Ottoman castle facing the Grand Mosque and defending the city from attack. However, the Saudi government removed the structure to give space for hotels and business buildings near to the Grand Mosque. Hira Arabic, Hi Ra is a cave near Mecca, on the mountain named Jabal and Nur Arabic, Yaba el al Nur, Mountain of Light, in the region of Tihama of present-day Saudi Arabia. It is notable for being the location where Muhammad received his first revelations from God through the angel Jibril Arabic, G B Ray Y L, who known as Gabriel to Christians. The Quran Gate, located on the Jeddah Mecca Highway, marks the boundary of the area where non-Muslims are prohibited to enter. It is the entrance to Makkah and the birthplace of Muhammad. The gate was designed in 1979 by an Egyptian architect, Samira Labd, for the architectural firm Idea Center. The structure is that of a book, representing the Quran, sitting on a rehal, or book stand. Economy <inaudible> 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 The Meccan economy has been heavily dependent on the annual pilgrimage. As one academic put it, Meccans have no means of earning a living but by serving the Hajis. Income generated from the Hajj, in fact, not only powers the Meccan economy but has historically had far reaching effects on the economy of the entire Arabian Peninsula. The income was generated in a number of ways. One method was taxing the pilgrims. Taxes especially increased during the Great Depression, and many of these taxes existed as late as 1972. Another way the Hajj generates income is through services to pilgrims. For example, the Saudi national airline, Saudia, generates 12% of its income from the pilgrimage. Fares paid by pilgrims to reach Mecca by land also generate income, as do the hotels and lodging companies that house them. The city takes in more than $100 million, while the Saudi government spends about $50 million on services for the Hajj. There are some industries and factories in the city, but Mecca no longer plays a major role in Saudi Arabia's economy, which is mainly based on oil exports. The few industries operating in Mecca include textiles, furniture, and utensils. The majority of the economy is service-oriented. Nevertheless, many industries have been set up in Mecca. Various types of enterprises that have existed since 1970, corrugated iron manufacturing, copper smithies, carpentry shops, upholstering establishments, vegetable oil extraction plants, sweets manufactories, flour mills, bakeries, poultry farms, frozen food importing, photography processing, secretarial establishments, ice factories, bottling plants for soft drinks, barber shops, book shops, travel agencies and banks. The city has grown substantially in the 20th and 21st centuries, as as the convenience and affordability of jet travel has increased the number of pilgrims participating in the Hajj. Thousands of Saudis are employed year round to oversee the Hajj and staff the hotels and shops that cater to pilgrims. These workers, in turn, have increased the demand for housing and services. The city is now ringed by freeways and contains shopping malls and skyscrapers. <laughs> Health care 
Health care is provided by the Saudi government free of charge to all pilgrims. There are ten hospitals in Mecca. Ajid Hospital Arabic. Mu s ta shish fe aj ya ad King Faisal Hospital Arabic. M s t shish fi al m l k f y s l b hi al shish shish h King Abdul Aziz Hospital Arabic. M s t shish fi al m l k b d al zi z b hi al za r al nor Specialist Hospital Arabic. M S T Shish Fi Al N Wur Al T K H S Sai Hira Hospital Arabic M S T Shish Fi H Ra Maternity and Children Hospital Arabic M S T Shish Fi Al Vlat Walid F Al King Abdullah Medical City Arabic M D I N T Al M L K B D Al Al T B Y T Kule General Hospital Arabic M S T Shish Fi K H L Y S Al M Al Kamel General Hospital Arabic M S T Shish Fi Al K M L Al M Ibn Sena Hospital in Bara Arabic M S T Shish Fi Ab N S Y N A B H Da B H Rach. There are also many walk-in clinics available for both residents and pilgrims. Topic Culture. Mecca's culture has been affected by the large number of pilgrims that arrive annually, and thus boasts a rich cultural heritage. As a result of the vast numbers of pilgrims coming to the city each year, Mecca has become by far the most diverse city in the Muslim world. In contrast to the rest of Saudi Arabia, and particularly Najd, Mecca has, according to the New York Times, become a striking oasis of free thought and discussion and, also, of unlikely liberalism. As Meccans see themselves as a bulwark against the creeping extremism that has overtaken much Islamic debate. The first press was brought to Mecca in 1885 by Osman Nuri Pasha, an Ottoman Wali. During the Hashemite period, it was used to print the city's official gazette, Al Qibla. The Saudi regime expanded this press into a larger operation, introducing the new Saudi official gazette Umm al Qura. Henceforth presses and printing techniques were introduced in the city from around the Middle East, mostly via Jeddah. Mecca owns its hometown paper, Al Nadwa. However, other Saudi and international newspapers are also provided in Mecca such as the Saudi Gazette, Al Madinah, Okaz and Al Balad. The first three are Mecca's and other Saudi cities primary newspapers focusing mainly on issues that affect the city, with over a million readers. Many television stations serving the city area include Saudi TV1, Saudi TV2, Saudi TV Sports, Al Ekbariya, Arab Radio and Television Network and various cable, satellite and other specialty television providers. In pre-modern Mecca the most common sports were impromptu wrestling and foot races. Football is the most popular sport in Mecca, the city hosting some of the oldest sport clubs in Saudi Arabia such as, al Wahida FC established in 1945. King Abdulaziz Stadium is the largest stadium in Mecca with capacity of 38,000. Cuisine <coughs> 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 As in other Arabian cities, kabsa, a spiced dish of rice and meat, is the most traditional lunch, but the Yemeni mandi, a dish of rice and tandoori cooked meat, is also popular. Grilled meat dishes such as shawarma, flat bread meat sandwich, kofta, meatballs, and kebab are widely sold in Mecca. During Ramadan, fava beans in olive oil and samosas are the most popular dishes and are eaten at dusk. These dishes are almost always found in Lebanese, Syrian, and Turkish restaurants. The mixture of different ethnicities and nationalities amongst Meccan residents has significantly impacted Mecca's traditional cuisine. The city has been described as one of the most cosmopolitan Islamic cities, with an international cuisine. Traditionally, during the month of Ramadan, men known as sagas provided mineral water and fruit juice for Muslims breaking their fast at dusk. Today, sagas make money providing sweets such as baklava and basbosa along with fruit juice drinks. In the 20th century, many fast food chains opened franchises in Mecca, catering to locals and pilgrims alike. Exotic foods, such as fruits from India and Japan, are often brought by the pilgrims. Demographics 
Population density in Mecca is very high. Most long-term residents of Mecca live in the Old City, and many work in the industry known locally as the Hajj industry. Iyad Madani, Saudi Arabia's minister for Hajj, was quoted as saying, We never stop preparing for the Hajj. Year-round, pilgrims stream into the city to perform the rites of Umrah, and during the last weeks of Du al qidah on average four million Muslims arrive in the city to take part in the rites known as Hajj. Pilgrims are from varying ethnicities and backgrounds, mainly Central Asia, South Asia, Southeast Asia, Europe, the Middle East, and Africa. Many of these pilgrims have remained and become residents of the city. The Burmese are an older, more established community who number roughly 250,000. Adding to the Hajj-related diversity, the oil boom of the past 50 years has brought hundreds of thousands of working immigrants. Non-Muslims are not permitted to enter Mecca under Saudi law, and using fraudulent documents to do so may result in arrest and prosecution. The prohibition extends to Ahmadis, as they are considered non-Muslims. Nevertheless, many non-Muslims and Ahmadis have visited the city. The first such recorded example of non-Muslims is that of Ludovico di Varthima of Bologna in 1503. Guru Nanak Sahib, the founder of Sikhism, visited Mecca in December 1518. One of the most famous was Richard Francis Burton, who travelled as a Qadiriya Sufi from Afghanistan in 1853. The Saudi government supports their position using Surah 928 from the Quran. O ye who believe! Truly the pagans are unclean, so let them not, after this year of theirs, approach the sacred mosque. Education Formal education started to be developed in the late Ottoman period continuing slowly into and Hashemite times. The first major attempt to improve the situation was made by a Jeddah merchant, Muhammad Ali Zainal Raida, who founded the Madrasat al Falah in Mecca in 1911 12 that cost £400,000. The school system in Mecca has many public and private schools for both males and females. As of 2005, there were 532 public and private schools for males and another 681 public and private schools for female students. The medium of instruction in both public and private schools is Arabic with emphasis on English as a second language, but some private schools founded by foreign entities such as international schools use the English language for medium of instruction. They also allow mixing between males and females while other schools do not. For higher education, the city has only one university, Umm al Qura University, which was established in 1949 as a college and became a public university in 1979. Topic. Paleontology In 2010, the Mecca area became an important site for paleontology with respect to primate evolution, with the discovery of a Sodinius fossil. Sodinius is considered to be a primate closely related to the common ancestor of the Old World monkeys and apes. The fossil habitat, near what is now the Red Sea in western Saudi Arabia, was a damp forest area between 28 million and 29 million years ago. Paleontologists involved in the research hope to find further fossils in the area. <laughs> Communications Telecommunications in the city were emphasized early under the Saudi reign. King Abdul Aziz al Saud, Ibn Saud pressed them forward as he saw them as a means of convenience and better governance. While in King Hussein's time there were about 20 telephones in the entire city, in 1936 the number jumped to 450, totaling about half the telephones in the country. During that time, telephone lines were extended to Jeddah and Taif, but not to the capital Riyadh. By 1985, Mecca, like other Saudi cities, possessed modern telephone, telex, radio, and television communications. Limited radio communication was established within the kingdom under the Hashemites. In 1929, wireless stations were set up in various towns of the region, creating a network that would become fully functional by 1932. Soon after World War II, the existing network was greatly expanded and improved. Since then, radio communication has been used extensively in directing the pilgrimage and addressing the pilgrims. This practice started in 1950, with the initiation of broadcasts the day of Arafah, and increased until 1957, at which time Radio Maka became the most powerful station in the Middle East at 50 kilowatts. Later, power was increased to 450 kilowatts. 
Music was not immediately broadcast, but gradually introduced. Transportation Air Mecca has only the small Mecca East Airport with no airline service, so Mecca is served by King Abdulaziz International Airport IATA, JED, ICAO, OEJN located at Jeddah, about 100 km from the city centre. To cater the large number of Hajj pilgrims, this airport has a specifically built Hajj terminal which can accommodate 47 planes simultaneously and it can receive 3,800 pilgrims per hour during the Hajj season. Rail al mashar al mugadisa Metro al mashar al mugadisa Metro is a metro line in Mecca opened in 13 November 2010. This 18.1 km elevated metro transports pilgrims to holy sites Mount Arafat, Muzdalifa and Mina in the city during Hajj reducing the congestion on the roads. Topic. Mecca Metro Mecca Metro, officially known as Makkah Mass Rail Transit, is a planned four-line metro system for the city. This will be in addition to the al mashar al mugadisa Metro which carries pilgrims during Hajj. Topic. Intercity A high-speed intercity rail line Haramain High Speed Rail Project also known as the Western Railway is under construction in Saudi Arabia. It will link along 444 kilometers, 276 miles, the Muslim holy cities of Medina and Mecca via King Abdullah Economic City, Rabig, Jeddah and King Abdulaziz International Airport. This rail line is planned to provide a safe and comfortable transport in 320 kilometers per hour, 200 miles per hour electric trains in turn reducing the travel time to less than 2 hours between Mecca and Medina. It will be built by a business consortium from Spain. Topic: <inaudible> <inaudible> Roads. Some of the intercity highways which connects the city of Mecca are: Highway 40, Saudi Arabia, connects Jeddah to Mecca and Mecca to Dammam. Highway 15, Saudi Arabia, connects Taif to Mecca and Mecca to Medina. Topic: <inaudible> <inaudible> Sister cities. Medina, Saudi Arabia Merv, Turkmenistan Istanbul, Turkey Taif, Saudi Arabia See also Meccan Sura Mecca Time List of expeditions of Muhammad in Mecca References Topic. Bibliography The Editors of Time Life Books, 1999. What Life Was Like in the Lands of the Prophet, Islamic World, AD 570-1405. Time Life Books. ISBN 0-7835-5465-6. Lapidus, Ira M. A History of Islamic Societies. Cambridge University Press. ISBN 0 521 22552 3. Topic. Further reading Bianca, Stefano. 2000. Case Study 1 The Holy Cities of Islam The Impact of Mass Transportation and Rapid Urban Change. Urban Form in the Arab World, Zurich, Ed Zurich, ISBN 3728119725 256 Bosworth, C. Edmund, ed. 2007. Mecca. Historic Cities of the Islamic World. Leiden, Koninklijke Abril. Dumper, Michael R. T., Stanley, Bruce E., eds. 2008. Maka. Cities of the Middle East and North Africa, Santa Barbara, USA, ABC Clio Rosenthal, Franz, Ibn Khaldun The Mukaddimah, An Introduction to History. Princeton University Press. 
ISBN 0-691-09797-6, CS1 maint, multiple names, authors list link. Watt, W. Montgomery. Maka, the Pre-Islamic and Early Islamic Periods. Encyclopedia of Islam. Edited by, P. Behrman, T. H. Bianchi, C. E. Bosworth, E. Van Donzel and W. P. Heinrichs. Brill, 2008. Brill Online. 6 June 2008 Winder, R. B. Maka, The Modern City. Encyclopedia of Islam. Edited by, P. Behrman, T. H. Bianchi, C. E. Bosworth, E. Van Donzel and W. P. Heinrichs. Brill, 2008. Brill Online. 6 June 2008. Quraysh. Encyclopedia Britannica. Britannica Concise Encyclopedia Online, 2007. Retrieved 19 February 2007. Topic. External links Holy Mecca Municipality Saudi Information Resource, Holy Mecca Personal Narrative of a Pilgrimage to Al-Madinah and Mecca, by Richard Burton <laughs>